Hey, so let's go over the use of styles in your model. Styles are located in the right-hand toolbar, right-hand toolbar uh, under materials. There's materials, the checkerboard box, and right below that is called styles. If you hover over any tool, it will just show you in this little window what it's called. So styles are ways of viewing your model. The structure of the objects in your model does not change but the look of them changes. So this could be a really cool way to uh, present something that you created in SketchUp in a really interesting way, as if it were done in different materials. So where it always starts with this illusion of grass and sky is default styles, simple style two. It will show you when you open styles, which one you're in, okay? And that's under default, means it gives it to you automatically. That's how it was set. But if you come under like um, assorted styles, for instance, and drop down that window, these are some assorted styles. If you ever want to close it because it gets too busy, look for that, look for that little um, drop down arrow and just click it to collapse it. So open it up. And here's a style. This looks like uh, brush strokes on canvas. This could be cool. If you click on that, you'll see how it changes the look of your model without inherently changing your model itself. So now all of the edges look like they were done with like a little paintbrush um, on paper. See how it looks like grainy paper. It's so cool that they were able to do this, but it's not really there. It's just an illusion. It's so cool. You could pick different styles like uh, this vignette. This is pretty. Let's see what this looks like. What kind of paper it puts it on and all that. Can it do it? Moving slow. Oh, there's vignette. So it's really grainy, like it's an old photograph or something, still with those lines on it. That's cool. Let's look at some other styles. Color sets. Um, this is interesting because it sometimes it completely changes the colors in your model. Like, um, uh, what's this one? That's, oh, that's very clean. Greens. Okay, so it takes everything with green tones on it. All the objects get a green tone. What's this? Mint green. Should be similar. Okay, cool. So there are different ways of changing the look of your model without inherently changing your model itself. Let's look at uh, photo modeling, sketchy edges, and you can look around here all you want. Here's like chalkboard. Yeah, chalk on green board. So here's the look of some of these old chalkboards that people would write on. Isn't that cool? The things you created now look like they were created with uh, pieces of chalk on a blackboard. It's so cool. Okay, I just wanted to show you that so you can have some control and some understanding of the tools that are in the right-hand toolbar and how you view your model. Thanks.